This is a different kind of little video. I might look a little gross because I just ran on the treadmill, so my face was a little sweaty and gross and stuff. But I did want to take a bath afterwards and use one of the jelly bombs that I got for Halloween. The ones that I got for Halloween um, from Lush, and I know that people were saying that they possibly wanted to see a demo of one of the jelly bombs, so I have one now. I can't wait to show you guys what it does. I can't wait to see what it does because I have never used one of the jelly bombs, so I'm so excited. Oh my god. I am going to be using the Dark Arts Bath Bomb, which is Harry Potter inspired, which is why I'm going to use it. I love me a good Harry Potter. My cat is scratching at the bathroom door. Not your time to come in. Thank you, though. So let's just get on with the show. Just a quick warning. Um... I don't have good lighting in here. I don't have a good camera. I'm literally using my phone. If you want, like, high resolution <laughs> um, Lush videos, I would actually suggest somebody that I love watching. Her name is Gwen, and I'm going to link her channel down below, actually. She does great Lush bath bomb videos. She even has, like, an underwater camera and stuff, so if you want to see, like, high quality things, go over there. But still, in the meantime, watch my shitty low quality one and listen to my review afterwards. I don't know, I'm very excited, let's start. use any like dust flying past or any orbs but this is kind of what the water looks like when the bath bomb is mostly fizzed out so you can see the regular water here I'll touch it and then watch I'll touch the jelly <laughs> oh my god that's so weird it's so sparkly though wow okay I'm gonna hop in and I will let you guys know afterwards what I thought this is freaking amazing also my camera really hates focusing wow use the yellow nail because I painted my nails red last week and they have not turned back to regular color but I think this is all jelly and it's not actually like coming apart this is gonna sound really gross on video and I'm gonna hate editing this but it's all just like I don't know it's not fizzing out even when I like hold it under the water I don't know oh you can hear it oh you can see it Anyway, hopefully that helped. Hopefully that helps it fizz out some more. So, so far, you can see it is leaving. <laughs> you can hear it fizzing. You can see it's leaving some residue on the side of the bathtub. People say that you can just like rinse it and it like go away, like look it. And it's basically all gone. Well, I mean, my hand doesn't really, <laughs> it's not, <laughs> it's not gonna work right now because of the color, but. Yeah, apparently this is all going to, like, dissolve. Um, my legs are turning black, which is cute. So we will see what happens. Okay. So I actually forgot to vlog after um, my bath, and wow, I look even worse. I look dead. What is going on? The bath was really nice. I actually really liked playing with all of the jelly on the top of the water, and it actually made my skin really soft. I liked picking it up and like rubbing it all over my body. I don't know. It was really nice. I smell really good. Um, the only issue that I had with the bath bomb or the jelly bomb is that there was a cleanup afterwards, which I was expecting. Um, most of it just wiped away with 
water or just like like water spraying on it or just like a little bit of paper towel however there was a stain left in the bottom of my tub me and my mom tried a lot of different things and it's still kind of there which sucks but I did really enjoy the bath it was really nice it was really relaxing I didn't give you a review directly afterwards because I was on FaceTime with Mike so I didn't really have time to record anything but I do now so that is my review honestly I would give it like a four out of five. I really do like the smell. I like the jelly bits of it. I think it's really cool. Um, I do wish that the middle of it would have dissolved instead of me having to force it to dissolve. I actually had to end up crushing it um, in the water because it wasn't going to dissolve. And the stain left in the bathtub was also a downer, but otherwise I did really like the bath bomb. So yeah, if you guys are thinking of getting a jelly bomb, then I definitely think that you should. Just a warning though, it could stain part of your bath which is not good. I think it just did it because of the dark color though. I don't think any of the other jelly bombs would do that. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this little review, little show of the belly. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little review and show of the jelly bomb. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up um, and make sure that if you're not subscribed already that you subscribe. I don't put out a ton of Lush videos, but I do put up a few, especially once I do a small haul. I usually put up a video then. If you guys want to follow me on any of my social media, go on my Discord, whatever, all of that is linked down below as well. Same with my second channel. What else is down there? There's lots of stuff down there. Remember to check out Gwen, who I said that I would um, link down below before. She does really great Lush videos, and I think that you guys would love her if you do like Lush videos in general. Hope that you guys have a really good night or day, afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are, and I will talk to you guys another time. Bye!